It's my pleasure to introduce to you Creo 2.0, which continues to deliver on our Creo vision and strategy right on the heels of the Creo 1.0 release less than a year ago in June of last year. The key theme for Creo 2.0 is to unlock your designer's productivity. And there are three areas in which we feel like we're gonna significantly improve productivity. The first one is with the recent release of our options modeler app to allow you to create and validate modular products. The second one is a significantly expanded ability for you and your users to explore more design concepts with new design tools across many different apps. And the third one is for those users that are using Pro Engineer Wildfire 4 or Wildfire 5 today, a significant improvement in workflow productivity across many areas of our flagship Creo Parametric app. We've also introduced two new apps. I mentioned earlier, Creo Options Modeler. We've also now brought to production Creo Layout. Creo 2.0 brings to bear hundreds of improvements for users across many, many apps that I think you're really gonna enjoy. Companies wanna offer product diversity, either based upon market pressures or customer choice with little or no increased cost. And Creo Options Modeler gives customers a dedicated app for the designer to create and validate modular products in 3D. It's easy to, easy to create modular product architectures, but to change or add new choices to your product architecture with Creo Options Modeler. Creo Options Modeler is available as a standalone app for those users that don't need the full power of the fully integrated parametric environment when they're doing their options design, or it's available as an extension to Creo Parametric to give you the full breadth of power of the parametric application while investigating different modular product choices. This is the first app that features our AnyBomb assembly technology, which connects Creo intimately with Windchill to generate and validate precise 3D representations of your product configurations defined by an individual bill of material from the Windchill environment. With Creo, you're gonna be able to explore more concepts with new design tools across many, many apps. Many of our customers tell us that the business challenge today is to explore these concepts more quickly so they can make sure they choose the right concept at the beginning of the development process, it leads to better success of the development project in the end. And with the Creo family of software, we have great new technologies to help you capture these concepts digitally sooner and earlier in the development process. For instance, first of all, you can build sketches with Creo Sketch. Creo Sketch has now been released on the Apple platform so that you can now have a broader use of this uh, application across your enterprise. Once a user is happy with the sketch they've created with Creo Sketch, designers can reuse that sketch directly in Creo Parametric, for instance, using our freestyle technology to build subdivisional surfaces around that sketch for an industrial design of a new product. With freestyle and Creo 2.0, we've added the capability to further subdivide the uh, surface model to get finer control over the design very, very quickly. Creo Direct has helped accelerate bid proposals already with Creo 1.0, and in Creo 2.0, we've expanded the capabilities to work more efficiently in the assembly process. Now designers can create more compelling 3D designs working right in the assembly context the way they'd like to work by modifying existing models that they have already in their Creo parametric database or by starting from scratch to develop new concepts quickly and easy using the direct modeling paradigm. For those involved in engineering-driven concept design, we released Creo Layout with Creo 2.0. Creo Layout gives design engineers the opportunity to explore design concepts in 2D, but to reuse all of that 2D data directly in the 3D environment. For a period of time, the 2D and 3D design engineer can work together, maintaining the link between the 2D and 3D design, and then when they see the right opportunity, they can break that link and just move the design fully into 3D and go on from there. For users that use Pro Engineer Wildfire, and Wildfire 5, Creo Parametric can boost their design productivity significantly. First of all, we have a modern user experience with a new fresh interface based upon the Microsoft Ribbon standard. It's easily adoptable from Pro Engineer users. For instance, we have a command finder tool that will allow you to find any command that you're used to looking for in Pro Engineer Wildfire 4. We've got many, many new workflows and capabilities built into the product that up to double your design productivity with just the standard things you do on a day-to-day -day basis. There's hundreds of new major, major capabilities in the product, including fee style, lightweight graphics, lots of great workflows in assembly context, and so forth. You can also load large assemblies up to 10 times faster with Creo Parametric relative to Pro Engineer Wildfire 4 and Wildfire 5. 
Secondly, Creo Parametric is our highest quality release by our measures ever from PTC. We're really excited about how stable the product will be when you get it and use it in your workflows. We also feel that Creo Parametric will be the most easily adopted release you've ever had from PTC. We've got a built-in learning connector with over 200 tutorials built in right there, context sensitive with exactly what you're doing in Creo Parametric so you can explore and learn about what you're doing right there in the app. Or we've got a more structured training approach with between half and one day formal training on various topics throughout the product. And then finally, and really importantly for our users, ProEngineer Wildfire 5 and Wildfire 4, really any ProEngineer data, loads into Creo without any data migration whatsoever. Everything you've done with your data with PTC CAD in the past is completely honored in Creo Parametric. Creo 2.0 delivers new technology, new apps and extensions with over 490 enhancements that make Creo 2.0 the most significant CAD release ever from PTC. We think you should make Creo 2.0 your target release for 2012. To find out more about Creo, visit the product pages on ptc.com.